Hello all, how are you? I am Bhavarlal, a Marwadi from Alwar district of Rajasthan. Rajasthan is known for its palace, sandy deserts, camels and food, Rajasthani Thali. But do you know, it is also known for its marvelous yet simple water structure. Today, I am going to take you to one of such water structures known as Johads. Johads are traditional harvesting rainwater storage ponds which are constructed for low rainfall area. It has a crescent shape bund on one side which helps to collect water. The excess water from the Johads helps to recharge groundwater table and wells. They are usually constructed along the rural or urban settlements or near religious structures like a mandir or masjid. You can found a johad below the foothills. Does it sound interesting to you all? Let me tell you that we lost the johads in between 1940 to 1985. But the heroic attempt of few brave people has revived Johads. Let me take you to the inspiring history of Johads in Alwar district. When there was a drought like situation, Johad was a source of water. Villagers used to construct and maintain Johads. Forest construction was another activity done along with it. In 1890, 60% of the land was covered by forest. Funding for Johads and forest was given by local rulers and kings. But after 1940, kings sold their forest land to loggers. Oh goodness! The logger cut all the trees which led to deforestation. This led to decrease in rainfall. So people went for a easy solution. They started using bore wells. The use of Johads became less and its use almost collapsed. But in few years even the bore wells dried up. The district was declared as dark zone. Further extraction of groundwater was restricted. But here comes a heroic leader, Dr. Rajendra Singh from Tarun Bharat Sangh, who came up to Alwar in 1985. He understood the importance of Johad in the region and started constructing Johads with help of his colleagues and local villagers. In just one year, in 1986, Johad again started filling up with water and there was recharge of groundwater table. In a decade by 1996, Kopalpura, a village in Alwar district, had built nine Johads. This was a revolution in Alwar district and presently there are around 5000 Johads. This has improved the water quality and improved life of people. There was also revival of dried Arwari river which was dry for almost 60 years. So guys, this is the journey of Johads from darkness to its revival. I welcome you all to visit and explore Johats Khamma Ghani.